Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You have many advanced criteria that you can create in the criteria range in order to filter your selected table. In this lesson, we will review some of the advanced criteria techniques that you can apply to the criteria entered into the criteria range when creating an advanced filter. First, it should be mentioned that when you use a comparison operator, the values must be preceded by the equal sign. However, this causes Excel to evaluate the entry that follows the equal sign as if it were a formula. This can cause unexpected results when using comparison operators with text and number fields. Therefore, you should enter the comparison criteria in the following general format. Equals, double quote, comparison operator, and then the associated text or value by which you wish to filter the field, followed by the double quote. Now many times, when filtering data, you wish to see records where a field's value is equal to a value that's entered into your criteria range. So in these cases, you would enter equals, double quote, equals, then your entry, double quote, as the criteria. However, there are many other comparison criteria that you can use for text and number fields. So you can use the following comparison operators when creating complex criteria. You can use the greater than symbol, the less than symbol, greater than equals, less than equals, or the greater than, less than symbol, which means does not equal. So for example, entering the criteria expression of equals, double quote, less than, greater than, Chicago, double quote, under a city field in the criteria range would filter the table to show all records where the city field did not equal Chicago. Also note that you can use wildcard characters in order to search for unknown values. You can use the asterisk to represent multiple unknown characters, or you can use the question mark to represent a single unknown character. To use a wildcard character, just decide under which text field you want to place the criteria and in which criteria row. Then simply use the wildcard characters in conjunction with the known values to search for matching records. So for example, if you had a last name column, from which you wanted to filter for anyone whose last name started with a J. You could enter equals, double quote, equals J, asterisk, double quote, under the last name column as a wild card criteria. It's also possible to create a criteria that matches the first few characters in the field's value and returns any matching values. This is akin to setting a criteria that looks for fields that begin with. In this case, you do not enter any comparison operator into the criteria, but rather enter only the first characters for which you want to find matches. So for example, entering car as a criteria underneath a last name field would return last names that begin with car, like Carson and Carlisle. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.